It's my first time doing it outside of my room. <laughs> Is it recording? No, 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 not yet. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is your pal Michael. So for today, for the very first time, I will vlog ako outside of the four corners of my room. It started kahapon na medyo gloomy yung weather dito sa Bangkok and it made me crave for comfort food. And no food could give me that comfort aside from the food that comes from home. So for today, I'm going to uh, try out a restaurant, a Filipino restaurant na Nag open last May 6. Last April 30 here in Thailand, the government announced that the restaurants can reopen, but they have to pass a certain safety and hygiene certification before they can reopen. And today I will be accompanied by my friend who will I meet up at the restaurant now. So, anyway, samahan nyo ako to discover this Filipino restaurant in 3, 2, 1. Nasa gitna siya ng prong prong pati ng tong lo Pero sa tong lo, about 6 minutes from prong prong It will be around 8 minutes walking distance So pag MRT, uh, mukhang token yung pinaka ticket Pero kapag BTS, it's um I mean, BTS or SkyTrain, it will be like in a card form. So, we are going to BTS. I'm not sure if you can hear me well because I'm kind of in the surroundings. So, bababa tayo ng BTS Tonglo, or I mean, bababa kayo ng BTS Tonglo, and then exit number one, and then about five to six minutes walking as per um, sabi ni Google. I think nakikita ko yung kaibigan ko. I'm not sure if that's her. <laughs> Hi, me! Say hi to the vlog! I, I thought you were going to wait for me there. Yeah, I'm walking ahead. Like, yeah. So this is my friend, me. Yes! And I'm so her, hungry! Yeah, if you're going to read your hunger from 1 to 10, how hungry are you? Okay, but 10. Almost 10. Yeah, <laughs> okay. So, yeah, it's her first time. Is it your first time to try Filipino food? Yeah. Oh, okay. And the reason why we're going here is actually because of the dessert. It's the... Yeah. I mean, one of the reasons. It's because yeah. of the halo halo. Yes, I want to try that. She's been so interested about that. Um, I remember she showed me um, a picture of it before when we were at work. Yeah. So right now we're heading to Lola's kitchen. Well, Lola means grandmother. Ah, so it's like grandmother living or something? Something like that, yeah. certificate that they need to accomplish right before they can open again um, yeah like you have to follow with the like the yeah. title and venture so and then people need to scan this yes, to check in the restaurant or the department store that they have their food yeah. and then you okay you should, you should okay. Okay. that's cool So we're now here at Dona's Kitchen and we're currently checking for the menu items. Yes. Um, I'm quite not sure what to order because I really love my country's food so I don't know which one to recommend because I love all the items here. But I think we're going to try um, crispy pata and then um, dinuguan as well. So here in Thailand they eat uh, pork blood yes. so... I mean, there's a guarantee that she would eat it, but I don't know if she would like it. 
-hmm. And then what else? Uh? Should we go for this one? The one that you Okay, so it's all for for <laughs> Okay, okay, no problem. Oh, no, what what did we get? Oh, this one. Yeah, no. this one is <laughs> A few moments later. Okay, so we've decided the last item will Finally. be... Finally! <laughs> <laughs> Sinigang na bangus, or like it's milk fish in... Like tamarind soup. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I think that will be like a, similar to tom yam. Chai, huh? chai. Okay. But without the galanggal, without the... Without the other herb that you put there. Mm -hmm. And Shemper for the dessert, we're going to have halo halo. It's been a while, like, I haven't had halo halo for, um, I think two, three years now. But I, in Thailand, they also have their own um, Thai dessert, where also, where it also resembles halo halo. Mm -hmm. And maybe I could feature it in my next vlog. I really like tap tim crop. Yeah, I, I think it will be similar to one of the Thai desserts. Yeah. Yes. Today we're going to um, order now. So all of our foods are here. We've... <laughs> so are you ready to give your judgment? Yeah. Can I have like so the soup spoon all here? Yes, okay. yes. But, uh... So again, we ordered sinigang na bangus. We've got here kare kare, kasi hindi available yung kashipata and dinig dinuguan. So she's currently trying the sinigang. So how is it different from tom yam? No, I know what is different. It's like tom yam has the what is that? All the herb. Yeah. Thai like, style, like um, what is that called? Galangal. No, no, I have missed all the Thai herb. Lemongrass. Yeah, like those kind of thing. Mm -hmm. But we do have lemongrass, but it's on other dishes. But not this first. is like more clear, but it's like sour. Yeah, sour and clear. It's very really fishy. I really like it when it's like extra, extra sour. Mm. For this food, if you're going to rate it from 1 to 10. This, I would give um, probably 6. six. Okay, okay. But it's six that's fair, that's fair, fair yeah. Now, Especially for a first time learning. True. I can eat this and I will try this one. This is, what is it called? Dinuguan. Dinuguan? Dinuguan. Dinuguan. So dinuguan is like pork blood stew. <laughs> this is like a Oreo. <laughs> but okay, not not to just the what it looks. Yeah, at first I was a bit bothered if she's game to try dinuguan, but I realized that she mentioned earlier that um, they also have a version of pork blood uh, food in mm. Thailand. How is it? I'm curious as well. <laughs> It's normally really sour. Sour. It has salty, vinegar. Sour. Salty, sour. It has like their own taste. Let me show first. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Okay, I also taste it sweet. Sweet? <laughs> no, it has like their own smell of the pork blood. Mm. Mm. So it's actually like this really similar to the Thai pork noodle. Yeah. Yeah, they really yeah. take the put the uh, pork blood. Mm. So it's like they have their own that kind of smell. Very strong. And then it's like it's actually like it's the same. But it's just like you you know you put the condiments yeah. and you add a lot of vinegar. Yeah. But I think mm. this one is cooked a little bit longer than that because mm. from Kwetio it's like just fresh blood and then put it in the mm. hot mm -hmm. water and right. that's it, right? So uh, okay now. Nah. Okay. But for me it's this one will, I will raise up this seven, and then this is more five maybe. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So again, this got seven, this got five. <laughs> because I like this one actually. So far so good. Uh, Miyako is still liking the food. <laughs> And we also added um, lechong kawale because she's craving for something fried. Mm -hmm. But for now, um, she's going to try kare kare or I don't know how to say it in English. I don't know what to say in, in English. Look at this, like, this is the calling. This is like natural cardin. Chai, chai. This, this part will be like the best. Okay, so I'm gonna try that. We, yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry. Okay, then don't forget to have it with a little amount of shrimp paste. Mm -hmm. And then I put 
use a little bit. Yes. Mm. <laughs> mm. This is good, huh? Yeah. Okay, no more sour. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is like this is like sour oh, let me taste. region. This is like more on the creamy, rich, mm. uh, subtle flavor of ah. peanut. And here it comes our apa, our lechong kawale. Ah, salamat po. So, what's the rating? This is, this is very good. Mm. And I think I need to put this more. Like, I yeah. Like this. It's like a balance of like <laughs> saltiness and creaminess of that. Mm. Oh, yeah. But I kind of miss yeah. um, seafood, <laughs> seafood sauce. Thai seafood sauce. Oh, I see. It's, but, I mean, the Philippines there's also like seafood version of this. Na. Oh, really? Like, sh they use big prawns. Mm. It depends. Mm. And then I think for lechon poale, it's given. This one is given. <laughs> Who doesn't love a deep fried pork? Deep -fried. So it's yeah. given. It's number ten. So anyway, um, I think that's it. We're going to continue eating. Maybe I'll come back pag tapos na kami kumain. Kasi sobrang sarap naman ng food. I mean, especially dinaguan. I'm quite a fan of dinaguan. So yeah, enjoy mo namin kumain. Third time. So, this is actually what you really wanted to try? Yes. What is this? Ah, Sarah. What is it called? What? What is it? <laughs> now, what is this called? Hold on. My bed is already saying like boba, boba, boba. <laughs> it's I, it, exactly the same thing. <laughs> what is that? What is this? It starts with letter H. Hello, hello. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hello, hello. So, the final thing is a dessert. I'm just going to ask Miyako what she thinks of it. Well, we already actually ate it because we were so excited. Mm -hmm. But anyway, let's ask her opinion. It's so, so good. Can't stop eating. <laughs> Something like if you see, you would think about Filipino. Yeah? So, what's in there? Let's show them. We jackfruit, chamar. Chai. Jackfruit, and then what is this? Um, what is that? Potato, sweet potato. I think. So. Sweet potato and coconut. How you call this? Yeah, like something what? like coconut jelly. Co co coconut jelly. I'm not really sure how to call it in. Sako. We have like jelly. We have the. Um, I already like smashed in everything. <laughs> Sorry, so it's me too. Kind of see. Yeah. So anyway, I would not film any longer because I would just like to indulge in this food. So see you later.